Sunday, gang. How are we doing? How are we doing? Hope everybody is doing well. Uh, I'm doing better. Thank you, Foz. Hello, sweetie. How's it going? How are you? I just decided randomly that I wanted this font to be different because I, I was like, hmm, my top corner font I like, and then this one and this one. It's just using basic Arial. I'm like, we should change that. Arial is very much the... It's, it's, it's barely a step above Times New Roman, you know? Um, <laughs> I think you're just going to have to face it, Core, that if you if you want to catch the Pokemon that tends to spawn when I go live, you, you need to go to a different channel because my channel doesn't register being live uh, quick enough, I think. There's clear, clearly a, win a window where it doesn't think I'm live. Right, uh, which one is it? That one. Uh, this one. Let's change this. There we go. That matches the rest of what's on screen. There we go. There's a dabble in UI design. <laughs> ah, not a UI artist in the slightest. Oh boy. Abra escapes. Didn't even know it was there. That's what Abras do. They just teleport all over the place. Work for another few hours, but on that, I'm fine. I don't lose anything for the attempts on the off chance it works, I get a random Pokemon. Understandable. Understandable. But yeah. Um, I th I'm doing better today. It's cooler. Uh, yesterday was hell. Like, legitimate hell on Earth. I suffered yesterday. It's a good thing that I don't tend to stream on uh, a Saturday because that was awful, frankly. And if I if I did stream on a Saturday, I would have been tempted to cancel because that's how awfully hot it was. Just uh bleh, gross and sticky and humid. But it's better today because that humidity is starting to like let off a little bit because it's actually raining. No game sound and think of the CP also. CP? CP? But yes, yes, there is no sound there was no sound intentionally, but I suppose I can turn that. Channel points. <laughs> I have infinite channel points because it's my channel. Yeah. Though to to be fair, um, Spook's been chatting with me uh, about my stream schedule, and I've always been kind of adamant that I don't want to stream on Saturday so that I can have like a day to myself and a day to hang out with people because most people are off Saturday. Uh, but Spook was like, you can't deny that because most people are off Saturday, that's the, probably the best day to try to get the most viewers. So he's he's kind of pushing me to try streaming on Saturday, so I don't know if it's going to get added to the schedule every week, but maybe there will be the occasional Saturday stream, I don't know. We will see. Um, it, 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 yeah, it, it may be very sporadic or spur of the moment. I said that perhaps I would just like do a couple of test ones just to see how it goes. Because um, at the end of the day, this being this is my job and the goal is to try to get more people to watch me. I appreciate everybody who watches me. You know that I love you all dearly. God damn it. No, I, no, I need to wash my hands. Sorry. Let's hit stop. 
because I need to. Um, no, I need the um, party UI to kick in. All oh, right, I went back here to go collect some Pokeballs, huh? Monday to Wednesday are the slower days. Yes, maybe more Wednesday to be honest. Uh, Monday definitely, I think statistically is the worst. We did have a look at my analytics, uh, but my analytics are. Uh, difficult to look at in a sense because the bars look really big because, you know, let's be honest, the average viewership is so low, so it's like, you know, on one day if you have three people and on one day you have four people because it's only a small min-max, the bar size looks hugely different. Uh, but you need one day for you to be clear, this is also true mental health is important. Yeah, this is why I have always been adamant that Saturday is for me. Um, that ha That is always the uh, the main one. Of I need a day to be for me, otherwise I will scream and I will explode. Um, this is, uh, this is a, a known thing. I mean, I've got more pink ones, but I think the black ones are going to be the ones that are most useful. Okay. Monday is the start of the week. Wednesday, are we there yet? Yeah. The thing is, because the thing is, is that I mean, because it is my job, I also want to do it. You know, in like I, I'm, tr you know, I treat it as a job, so it's like. I don't know, Monday in my head still feels like it's a work day, which it is. Which is why I get the least amount of viewers, because everyone else is also at work. <laughs> um, so, you know, it can't be can't be helped really in a way. Yeah, and so Spook, Spook suggested, well, look, looking at the analytics, uh, you know, Monday's your worst day, maybe have Monday off. Swap some Saturday for, for Monday. And I said, yeah, very valid. Problem is, is that no one is off Monday. So if it's my day off and I want to do something, no one's going to be free. So, you know, I've got a day off to just sit around the house and do nothing because it's no one, no one, no one's available to go out anywhere. But occasionally Spook does have Monday off, which is, is good. We've got berry pots now, so we can have berries. I think... Uh, that we want to grow as many Petra Berries as possible, because poison is a worry. Always a worry. It's, um, it's hard. It's hard to judge. Because, uh, you know, when, when you're only, when you're only littered, um, the difference of one per, you know, the, the difference of four people watching you versus three people watching you is pretty big. Whereas when you're, if you were a bigger streamer, if you had three more people watching you on one day than another, you probably would just go, eh. That is the nitty gritty of the job I chose at the end of the day. Okay, uh, does this need to update itself? Yes, it does. Our team looks a little different from how it is on the UI. Ah. There we go, that's updated. So, as you can see, I did do some leveling. I did, in fact, do some leveling. It was needed. Uh, Fromage is still a little low, uh, and there is a reason for that. And that is that while I was leveling, uh, Fromage started the evolution sequence, so I had to stop it and immediately save and stop because we wanted to see that on stream. So uh, there we, that is why we are here. I still don't have fucking cut. I thought I'd talk cut to somebody. God, I wish we had fly. Uh, 
let's let's do this the other way around. we can now because we've got rid of the pseudo wudo that was actually a mana fee which kicked our butt and then died well that lx p bar from Arge, immediately out of the gate going to be evolving into something So his own HP to up to half its maximum HP on the next turn. Ah. Hello, sweetie. Hi. Oh, mm. I'm wondering why the shed's open. It's because they're stuck in the door. I noticed that the glass on the window was steaming up. Letting the warm air out. Sadie has been good today. She has been pretty much walking everywhere. I've not really noticed her dragging her legs at all. I've still been giving her... Even though I'm like a little busy ass. <laughs> yeah. See, oh yeah, so important update from, from Friday. Uh, Sadie is doing better. Um, she went to the vet yesterday and had a an injection. Uh, a painkiller injection, basically. And uh, it does seem to actually be working. Uh, so she... So to, again, to sort of recap, uh, the vet said that she had arthritis on her lower spine, uh, which was causing pain in her lower back and back legs, which had led to her not wanting to use her back legs, which had led to the mu muscles atrophy. So we were concerned because uh, she was basically just dragging herself around on her front legs and her back legs were just limp behind her. Uh, we So the vet gave us some temporary pain meds until they could get the stuff in. Yesterday they called me and said that we've got the kept the thing in, so we went yesterday to go get it, saying we had it. She came back home and obviously was tired from her day. Um, but this morning she is walking. She is walking. You know, I, I wouldn't say she's too wobbly either. She's not 100% steady, but she is walking. She is not dragging her legs. So the wonders of modern medicine. Um, as I just said to Spook, we're going to continue to do her leg exercises because her legs are still very thin. Um, you can see her, her her bones basically on her legs; they are very thin. Um, so we're going to be basically doing an exercise routine for Madame Sadie. Yes. So there's the, the recap for you. Sadie is doing better. The not having to have HM slaves added in remakes is so freaking useful. Yes, God. <laughs> God, the the, uh, the the quality of life changes that modern Pokemon gives gives us cannot be overstated. Alright, I do want to have Wish. I want to get rid of Snore. So I got to this screen and then I closed the game because I was like, nope. Oh, come on. Seriously? A shop it. Oh, my God. I don't even know if shop it's a step up from a Togepi. I feel like a Togepi doesn't have high stats. Maybe shop it is higher. Let's find out. Uh, Togepi. I love that the autofill is Togepi Squishmallow. I know what a Squishmallow is, it's a type of plush. What's the base stat total of a Togepi? Base stat total is... Uh, 2, 4, 5. Shuppet. What is the base stat total of a Shuppet? Two nine five, so not a huge difference, honestly. Cool. Fromage has turned into a Rogfort. No, I 
cheese has gone moldy! <laughs> oh no, they were moldy! Okay, you know what? Let's just nip this in the bud. You're going in the PC and we're putting Tesco back in because we love Tesco. Yeah, te you can see from our, our lineup, we, we swapped out Tesco just for the purpose of leveling because I was like, having a Flygon is too good to not level it up to the rest of the party's level. So that was the main, the main one. It's also why I'm over here, partly to get the Pokeballs, partly to go to lower leveled uh, areas, which are safer to level up in, even if it takes longer. So we've got Dundee and Fromage, who was a Togepi. Yeah, I didn't even bother with Dundee. <laughs> so we have a, a backup Pokemon, maybe. It is slightly lower level than everyone else. Yeah, Tesco, Zelda, and I will say I'm in love with the name Zelda, actually. Actually, I'm in, I'm in love with the name Zelda for a Flygon. I think it's wonderful. Uh, Banuka, Gulling, Orchestrin, and Gone Baggin. Tesco. So, yeah. When we have Kalava walking behind us, you could almost believe this is a normal playthrough. And then you realise we have a Flygon. <gasps> Actually, let's have- I've never seen Flygon's Overworld Spy. Look at them! Ooh, your Pokemon has got the scent of smoke. Oh, there was another black ape apricorn here. I could have used that. Yeah, uh, I'm, I'm glad that uh, eventually the Pokemon Company did come to the decision of we're not going to be keeping uh, TMs and HMs in the traditional sense anymore. A barbecue, yes. Let's just speed through here, okay? We've done all of this and it's all very low level. way before we're getting caught by Pokemon in the cave. I did think that. We only had three encounters in that whole cave. I swear when we went through that the first time and we were like, oh, this is our first time going into the cave. We've got to be careful. We had, like, so many encounters. We don't even really need to go to that center. Right, so then we're back here now. The site of our biggest success and our biggest failure. This is where we caught Zelda, but also where we lost our Slugma, Geralt. Oh no, Rivia. It was called Rivia after Geralt. To a goddamn lantern! confidence to be shattered because we have a rival battle, which is what I was terrified of last time. Do 
20 of those still, okay. I mean, don't know why I'm looking at revives, I can't use those. Uh, got 10 regular Pokeballs, 10 Great Balls. Hopefully it won't be too bad. Fingers crossed, I did try to level in Anticipation. I'm not gonna bother with Heal Ball. Smell all spook looking again. I love this. I love the aesthetic difference between, uh, like, quote unquote, normal buildings and Ecrateek City's buildings. Like, the Pokemon Center and the, the shop are clearly, like, the most modern thing. Because Ecrateek's whole vibe is that it's, like, the really old one. I think I said uh, last time that if they did do a Legends Cerebi, uh, and I feel like. Critique would be your pub, like how we had Jubilife Village over Jubilife City instead of like the starting town. I feel like this would be a good place to be your starting pub. Right, the burnt tower. <gasps> new zone, new zone, new zone. Ooh, who dat? Who dem? Dogs! Oh, let's go! Bitch. At least it can level easy. Yeah, it, it will evolve immediately. It will evolve immediately. You know what? I, I already know what I'm calling this. Screw the 5D one on this one. I already know what this is. This is... Anticipate. Anticipation. Ah. Hello, Minako Ye. Welcome to the chat. I've seen Jiggly Jiggly. I can't do that for very long. <coughs> yeah. I have like, to like do something with my throat to do that. Yeah. Really evolves into Arcus, could you imagine? I feel like I need the P. I need it to be Anticip... 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 Blue and Fursa. <laughs> Look, I'm a I'm a fan of a Frank and Fursa, okay? I like I like a, a hot dog. I like a hot dog. Hello you! My name is Yusin. I'm on the trail of the Pokemon named Suicune. Because my name is vaguely an anagram of it. And you are Blue Glatz Michi. I heard rumors that Suicune is here, so I came to look. Take a look at the basement through the hole in the floor. There, Suicune is down there. I could go downstairs, but I know it would run away in no time. 
I know, I have tried many times. There seems to be more than meets the eye with you. You seen wants so bad to be a protagonist in every iteration that they appear in. Every game they appear in, you seen wants to be a, the main character so bad. Hmm. Hi, Morty. My name's Morty, I'm Ecritique's gym leader because my old friend Yusin is here on the trail of Suicune and I decided to investigate the Burnt Tower. Ecritique is a legend about these legendary Pokemon, Suicune, Ensei, and Raikou. As a gym leader of Ecritique, I must have a proper understanding of it. I swore that dude was about to fight us. No, this dude's about to fight us. Oh, it's you. You must be here to catch the legendary Pokemon to make yourself look strong. That's only a dream. You see, the legendary Pokemon suits a trainer like me, who was sworn to become the strongest trainer. A battle with Team Rocket Grunts is right for you. A pseudo Udo, you say? See, I told you he was like level 20. Uh, is Steeling gonna do it? Yeah, it is. Dang. Didn't one-shot it, though. Ooh! Spicy! No, 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 no! No, thank you! Can we switch to someone a bit tonkier, please? I don't want to lose my Flygon in their first proper battle. Failed. Whew. I don't know what Metal Burst is, but I do not like it. Jeez, that stats was scary. Shalos. Oh no, oh this is gonna hurt. Or maybe it doesn't because the ghouling is tough as shit. Every time someone hits Bagooling with an ice type move, I'm like, ah, oh, this is gonna hurt, and then they take like no damage. Punch you in your face. have a grass type move, huh? Fortunately, I have an ice type. It's a good cup of tea. You're a nuzleaf, huh? against ground type moves. I god, Bagooling really is the MVP of the party sometimes just so goddamn tanky all the time. Ooh, there we go. Eesh, that one move that just like immediately floored Zelda and then Bagooling is just like what Woo! Whatever. You shouldn't be able to catch a legendary Pokemon anyway. Go 
Go away, Ethan Winters! That was, uh, terrifying. I would have been so upset if we had lost um, our Flygon. Metal Burst is a counter. Oh, that's why it hurts so much. If it goes first, it fails. Ah, so the going slow speed uh, played into its favor. Slow and steady wins the race. Let's save. Whopper, whopper, super whopper, junior double, triple whopper, favorite taste with perfect toppings. I will love it all. It's dead. Alright, time for plot. Suicune made the wrong sound. That's not Suicune's sound! Did you see it? Did you see it? Did you see it, chat? Did you see it? Did you see it? Suicune raced by like a blur right in front of my eyes. I've been chasing Suicune for almost ten years, but I've never seen this close. I'm all choked up. By the way, it was clear to me that Suicune took notice of my presence. A critique's legendary Pokemon is said to come to people only when they recognize their talents. Perhaps I should be more aggressive towards Suicune. Anyway, Blue, we will meet again. You seen? Away! Uh, I should be able to walk behind that pillar! Level 14 Siege. The level difference between the wild Pokemon and the and the rival battle. That's why I was leveling so much. Uh, all of these attacks are awful, but I guess so. Psycho Cut's probably our best bet. forget how the type matchup is between like iron ground and rock and stuff like that. Those are strength, they don't have strength at the moment. Uh, so there is actually nothing here for me to do right now. What do you have? Fire breather hanging out in a burnt building, a little um sus, you know. The werewolf. In, let me guess, it knows explosion. <laughs> uh... I couldn't remember what type we'd set judgment to because I'm pretty sure it isn't set to normal. Vaporeon? We know that Vaporeon is surprisingly strong. Yeah. He manages to resist judgment. The 100 hundred move.
They pour you on good beans. They are. They tonk it. Widely considered the the one of the better choices for the eaters. I I just want to keep drinking this tea because it's at the perfect temperature right now. Yo, the DLC for Scarlet and Violet is out in like three days. I need to pull my finger out and decide if I want to get that pre-order bonus, basically. If I want that, um, Hisui and Zoroark. Kinda do, but, you know. Like, I want to get the DLC, but I, I'm just kind of wondering if, like, buying a game right now is a sensible thing to do. Like, I said I wanted to do more collabs on Friday, and one of the reasons I haven't so far is because um, one of the people I wanted to collab with was like, yeah, sure, we can collab, how about we do this game? And I was like, um, I can't I don't really want to spend that much money at the moment. <laughs> Did that a while ago, yeah. I should have just pre-ordered it when it was announced, when I was more financially secure. <laughs> and then I wouldn't be stressing about it now. transfer over if that's all you want then waiting is an option yeah it's because it's the like it's 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 a couple of the things like it's a hisuian zoroark it's dark terror type which is great for various reasons and also like you know i'm a nerd it reminds me of my DD character let's be honest i've said a few times that hisuian zoroark reminds me of tala uh, but Tala would be a dark type, so the fact that it's uh, a dark type for Suey and Zoroark is, is very good. Um, it has the special move. I mean, yeah, it has a special mark. I don't tend to actually care too much if Pokemon have special marks, but I guess it's just bragging rights at the end of the day. That's why I'm, I'm just sitting here, I'm just like, is my Pokemon brain clouding my reason? I remember when Sword and Shield came out and then they did the Sword and Shield DLC that I was actually in a similar situation of like, I'm not going to buy the DLC because I don't have the money for it, like straight up. There was, I don't think there was a pre-order bonus, so I was like, I'm, I'm not going to get the DLC. And then I won it in a contest. Just like, by sheer chance, I won it in a contest. And I was like, oh, okay, I guess that solves that problem. <laughs> I'm not going to be drawing again this time. Yeah. Like, I do, like, it has, it has a move it can't normally learn. Let me Google what it actually does. Pokemon. It knows Happy Hour, which is, um, an event exclusive move, so you can't learn it naturally in any way. Uh, oh, Happy Hour's a little bit like Payday in a way. Happy Hour doubles the amount of prize money earned at the end of a battle. Yeah. Comes with an expert belt, damn. 
Yeah, I don't know if I am overthinking it. Would I use it? Probably not. What level is the Hisuian Zoroark that you get? Do you know, Kor? Do you know what level it is? Because it's one of those things where it's like, if they get... The problem with, with events is that sometimes they give you a level 100 Pokemon, and I'm like, cool, well, I'm not going to use it. Because... It's it to take you know it's it's already max level. I don't need to level it up. Which is why I was actually kind of happy to have a load the, the Mew given to you at like level five because now I'm like I might use the Mew in my team when I inevitably get round to playing the DLC. If you don't care about it, if you care about it, it's just another Pokemon to me, so I could trade it to you via home. Oh, would you? Really sweet. It would solve my dilemma. <laughs> Do you want something in return? Do you want a Do you want a different Hisuian Zoroark in return? Just like a normal one. Where's the Serebii event deck? Serebii... Uh, she is me! There is the original trainer. I'm pro I, it's probably healthy for me if I don't start obsessing over original trainers, to be fair. Because I know that there are people out there who do. Like, um, Austin John plays all the shinies that he gets. He only wants them to be his uh, original trainer. Like, he doesn't- he, he will never trade for a shiny. Oh right, Jim. I was like, what are we doing? Jim. Jim is what we're doing. Oh, should we level up Weedle? I've got a day or two to think about it. Uh, I may take you up on that. Alternatively, someone commissioned me and then I can use the money to buy it. There you go. <laughs> There is also that. Heck. This is only half a joke. game at the moment so I uh, can't pass it over right now so remind me later. Yeah 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 you do. I'm not gonna do it right now, I'm streaming. <laughs> hmm. In fact I don't think you don't need to trade it to home. If it's in Scarlet and Violet then you trade it then you trade it to me in Scarlet and Violet, right?
You! You! I kind of want Antisip to turn into a Joltik. <laughs> Why a Joltik? Also, Joltik isn't in this game. So it can be... Antiseptic. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> How do you think of them, Core? There's the Groudon. That's a little dung when it's like legendary. Yeah, well, so remember earlier in the playthrough when I was like, legendaries get different music. This, this is what I mean. The music is different. But yeah, there's just there's just Groudons in this route. We didn't encounter a Groudon, we put encountered Flygon, so we got the Flygon instead. I'm pretty pleased with the Flygon though, to be fair. I forgot that you know Afrojet. I'm also forgetting. I didn't mean to do that. Well. I can't catch it, it's a Nuzlocke! Years of puns and shitposting, understandable. While you- while you were out there studying normally, I studied the blade. <laughs> While you were but a child, I studied the blade. <laughs> yeah, if anything, it's funny that legendaries have different encounter music because it means if you ever have that come up in a patch of grass, there is just a moment of sheer horror where you're like, oh fuck, what am I about to see? On. I'm just trying to level up the Weedle. Runs away. Legendary dogs roam. <laughs> yep, they do. Hi, girls. <laughs> you you witness me at my most terrified. All the legendaries come for a visit. I know, right? Gee, I saw her Belugia doesn't appear. My my favorite legendary. Oh no, that would be awful. See, at least my knowledge of Pokémon was enough that I knew I could safely throw a Pokéball at it. I'm, I'm glad I at least knew that much. I was like, you get one turn, and it runs away. So I was like, fuck it. Full odds Ultra Ball, let's go. This is why I need Quick Balls. You little shit, you poisoned me. Wild Luke here appears. Oh no! Whatever shall I do? Oh, this is gonna take so long. Oh, 
Well, she'll be happy to know that my uh, my parents dropped off the uh, folding bed that they said I could have uh, yesterday. Though they did warn it is very much a, you know, don't, definitely don't be jumping on this. It is. <laughs> and I was like, I mean, why would you? But yes, I know that. <laughs> Not six. <laughs> so we can randomly find uh, the legendary dogs, which sucks, because this is a Nuzlocke. I just realized I threw a Pokeball at a Pokemon, which was not a legitimate catch. We have already caught a Pokemon in this route. We would not be allowed to have kept the intake if I had somehow miraculously caught it. Those are the rules. It is very unlikely we will ever get to have the legendary dogs. to think that you could, if you were very lucky, uh, potentially get a legendary on your team before the fourth gym in this game. If you were very, if you got really lucky, and what just happened to me happened to you, but if you say like you had a Pokemon that knows in prison, which stops it from running away, and then you you had like a quick ball or, so, or you had like a quick ball and you got really lucky, you could have a level forty legendary on your team. I feel making the rules ch uh, change for Romas is acceptable. Ah, oh, no, guys, I don't know. It's the, them's the breaks. It's the rules. It's the rules of the Nuzlocke. I am. I am interested that they are still legendaries, and that it's not just a something else. As long as it's random and not searched for. I don't know, guys. Anticip- Let's go, let's see what they evolve into! Anticip- Hunts! 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 Look at the- oh my god! Look at that sprite! It's smiling! Ah! Look at them! Oh my goodness! Anticipony! Oh my god! It's an Anticipony! Oh, and they evolve at level 40! Oh my goodness. It actually knows a fire type move, which is hilarious. Wow, I've never seen a pony tire in a netball. There we go. Cool. Right, well, uh, unfortunately, because you are literally half the level of the team, you are going back in the box. Yep, level 40, which is why it, everybody. Again, to go back to the famous moments in Legends Arceus where everyone goes, a wild rapidash! Uh, and then everyone's like, "That's that's crazy! How can you get? A, how do you get a wild rapidash?" And then you go up to it, and you're like, "Oh, because it's level forty. This is at the start of the game, so you've got a level five starter." I almost want to shake the hand of the dev who was like, "You know what would be funny if you put a level forty Pokemon right at the start of the game? That would be funny, because <laughs> it was." Comedic value. Right, it's gym time. Which means I am terrified. We have a bad track record with gyms. And famously, it is not the gym leader who is the problem. It's one of the NPCs inside the gym who is the problem. Uh. 
Legend, Legends Arcus is one of those games where, if it, you know, if you if, if you had a game that you could play for the first time again, that, you know, there's a lot that you could pick, but I think Legends Arcus definitely goes on that list of, like, experiencing a Pokemon game like that was just... Ah! Oh, five-year-old me was just so ecstatic from playing Pokemon Yellow on my Game Boy to that. So good. Okie dokie. Uh, uh. Hmm, the uh the lighting is bugged. <laughs> Fun. Ooh, a full team of a team, team of five. As I say, that's not that's not a full team of six. That's five. Count. Count. Ah, count. Ah, count. Sad. Am I the only kid who thought that that was for Cade when they were little? Anybody else? Just me. Sleep powder. Ooh, being able to put someone to sleep is very handy. It's the low, ac it's the low accuracy. Believe it. I feel like Skarmory needs a little bit of love. I know, right? I like Skarmory. I like Skarmory. It's a cool Pokemon. Maybe like a pre-evo or something. I yeah, I I feel like Skarmory could maybe like Giraffe Rig. It should have had a a new evolution. Like I feel like a pre pre-evo doesn't give it any love because it's something that gets skipped over. So I think it could do with having a a new evolution. Or you know, it could have it could have been one of those ones that would benefit from like a mega form. Curls, I know you're thinking about the Drawfy joke. Spell, but quite effective. <laughs> Brazer Wind. That's that misleading one, which isn't a. Yeah, Brazer Wind isn't a flying type. I uh, know, I'm not going to use a two to. Dodrio, I don't have any electric moves. Ooh, I got ice moves though. What am I doing? <laughs> RIP Jabba, didn't get to live to see your third, third head. And Onyx! Rocky boy! Oh yeah, because she went here earlier. A little update on Sadie. She had an, an injection yesterday, and she is walking more normally today. She she is walking, so she she's improved. Fuck! I didn't see what we were battling. Silku. Okay. Actually, he know me, me too. He has logged off. <laughs> the salt. 
The salt is the salt is delicious. Become that which you hate. Play the Mewtwo. <laughs> if Mewtwo is still on rotation the next time we play, I might actually try it. <laughs> Consumed by the salt, lost in the salt. I don't think they are, to be fair. Yeah, they're probably too new. Boo! There's at least one per team per match, though. Ugh. Topic, but Starfield either has a Scissor or Scyther reference or a Fomantis reference. Core, there's this funny little thing that exists that is called a Praying Mantis, which is a real life insect that exists. Ah, oh, if you walk off the edge, you get teleported back to the front. Even in ranked, it's my hell. Oof. The meta has been shooketh. What? Does he have an established counter? He must do. Like, I feel like if he's that broken, surely they must have. They should be patching something. Me playing with one of the speakers with my foot. I would just say my fit. I'm in full relax mode. If, if, actually, you know. At, at rest, my feet are up on the desk, which is mainly so that my feet are in front of the fan. But I am reclined. The meta is dead on the ground, it's just Mewtwo versus Mewtwo and everybody else is here. Oh dear. I'm gonna drop a save just because we haven't done one in a while. The ship you get is called Razor Leaf, so it's a mantis with Razor Leaf. I'm not sh Razor Leaf is a grass type move. I don't think Scyther can learn Razor Leaf. A mantis might. Pokemon Razor Leaf. Safe. Razor Leaf. Let's see. Ba -ba 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 -ba. No, no scyther. No scissor. Uh, yeah, Fomantis can learn it. And Lurantis. I looked up its counters. Uh huh. Literally any Pokemon that can disable moves, and that's it. <laughs> so the way you counter it is by stopping it being muted. You literally just go, don't stop. If you can turn it off and on again, oh my god. Yes, Wonder, thank you. I was looking at Razor Leaf. Also, hi, Jackie. I haven't seen you in ages. How are you? Ah. Big gulp. This is a supreme thirst. I should have used Psycho Cup. Been busy with IRL stuff. I mean, mood. That's, that's huge. Wow. I hope you're doing okay, though. I have so much water I'm clinging to it like my life depends on it. Amen. It feels cooler today. Everybody in the UK staring out the window at the sky going, RAIN, DAMN YOU! WHERE'S THE RAIN?! GIVE ME THE RAIN! It's only 23 today, which was so much better. It was it was basically 30 yesterday. It was five degrees cooler, which is game changing. We have rain here, we're sending it north. Give! Give me the rain. Give me the goddamn rain. It's too warm. 
Uh, Kyoga, a pool. Yeah, cool. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you have a legendary. Um... <laughs> if I'm scared, I should just hide behind the ghouling. Okay, I'm shit the stream currently uh, on the way to work, but I hope you're having a good stream. Thank you! It's very much appreciated. You're having a good old time melting. It was so hot we had a power cut, it fucked up the wires. What the hell? Wow. The UK is not designed for heat. Oh, of course, you paralyzed me. Rich kid with a legendary. I know, right? Terry and Darrington energy. <laughs> I love how I open up my, my weather app and it's like, warning, potential disruption due to thunderstorms. And I'm like, where, bitch? Where? <laughs> where are they? Show them to me. <laughs> I also ended up needing uh, to walk from one village to another, and let me tell you, it did not go well. Oof. Oof. How long did that take you? Rich Kid Scott. He was actually an old woman. I'm gonna go heal again, cause I'm scared. We've had two casualties in, in gyms. I'm not taking chances. Not that long, but it was in 30 degree direct sunlight while carrying stuff. You know, ideal conditions. Why would you do that to yourself? Oh my god. Yesterday I was just like, hired from the heat. Today I did actually go for a walk. I was out. I actually went out for like a good hour. Um, and literally my goal was just to play Pokemon. I was literally like, there's there's three gyms down, down at the common. And I've got quests that need doing. And I need coins desperately so i'm gonna go fight those three gyms and go get some get some coins so i did and it was nice very much an accident did not mean to happen it's 26 today but at least rain yeah it's surprisingly it's cooler like that my phone is currently saying it's 23 and we've not had the rain yet but it's it does say that this is basically the temperature for the rest of the day yeah, yeah, but I guess you're closer to um, you're closer to London. God, you know, you know, London's gonna be like thirty degrees today, and it was probably like thirty-five yesterday or something stupid. We have one Pokemon. It is a Weavile. Okay. Steel. I'm not 100% sure of the reasoning why ice is weak to steel, but I have at least been able to memorize it fairly, fairly well. We were meant to have we were meant to have thunderstorms for the next three days. Hallelujah! Yeah, I, when I look at the forecast next week and it's just rain, 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 and it's like 16 degrees, 18 degrees, 20, 19. I'm like. Mm. <laughs> London is thirsty. Yeah, oh, God. Hey, London. London is the worst. Oops, we've had a glitch. Literally, as I was like, time to save. What about 40 like here in summer? You're used to it, Buzz! You live in Greece! You have air conditioning! I assume cold makes th things brittle. Yeah, I, I don't know if it's- if, isn't that- is there like a thing that's called like... Frostburn or something? Is it, or is it to do how like, you know, if, if metal gets cold... 
But why is steel type weak to ice? Oh, it's the other way around. Why is ice weak to steel? I think it's I think it's just that the steel can shatter it. <laughs> yeah, that's so typical. I clicked on a Reddit post. Where someone goes, steel types effectiveness doesn't make sense. And there's like five paragraphs of them talking about it, and then the top voted response is it's a kid's game. <laughs> uh-huh. Let's see. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. Reload the ROM. Literally makes it look like you're playing an indie horror game or something off the PlayStation demo disc. Jump scare vibes incoming. Yeah. I don't know if you guys remember when I was making the co the cobble. Uh, we we had that glitch that turned it into like a massive kite. It was like a it, like the in VR chat. It was like height sixty foot, and it was like this massive like kite shape with like horrendous claws. I've actually screenshot that and saved it because I'm like, yo, if I ever make a horror game. That's a good foundation for a- for a monster. <laughs> there we go. Quick refresh. Halloween is coming, boys. This is Halloween. This is Halloween. <laughs> Halloween, 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 Halloween. <laughs> Stronger every day. <laughs> I think she's the last one before Morty. Another rich kid, huh? Pinchy! My thesis is the only thing containing me. I hope that's going well, especially given how shaky the last week was. I hope things are well in the household as well. Once it is complete, I will ascend. Yes, you will. Up the country, to my house. Fighting type? Ha <laughs> how cute. Extra sensory. <laughs> Extra sensory. <laughs> Everything's fine here. Situation normal. How are you? TikTok where Cobble turns into that and scares all the people that hurt it, but it's only a dream and he falls off the bed. That would require me to have to remake it though, because I don't I don't have, you know, because it was a glitch, I didn't keep it, so I would have to intentionally remake it. This did not do as much damage as I was hoping it would. It's not very effective. Why did I think it would be super effective? Ouchie! 
This is not an advisable situation. I had the beginnings of a spooky one slash two shot in my head. We'll see if anything comes of it. I've been watching Candle Obscure and it's giving me inspiration. Ooh, okay. As with most things, like, like, D20 and crit roll. I'm, I'm aware of things' existence and I get exposed to like fan art and people's reactions, but I never watch the actual thing itself. <laughs> like, I, I, I got shown uh, in my recommended a bunch of clips of uh, the fix, apparently. Uh, it, see it seemed falling in love with somebody who was uh, spouting bird facts, and I love that. I was like, oh my god, Brennan gets to actually in-game use their bird facts with somebody. Passion! That's, their name is Passion! Oh my god, I love that. The fix and passion, I love that. Okay, yeah. Teleport we get to that. Mentopolis is incredible. I do want to watch it. I, I even showed Spook the trailer and I was surprised uh, that Spook knew who Hank Green was. <laughs> This just goes to show the Venn diagram of the internet it is actually a circle. Final episode on Wednesday. Bingeable. Ooh. What we need to do is finish Starstruck, because me and Spook actually st started watching Starstruck in the flat, with the whole, uh, you know, computer connected up to the TV. Um, we did start watching it, and, and then we, we stopped. I think we got, like, five episodes in you know so you know a reasonable amount obviously still a ways to go but not like it's not like oh we watched one episode and stopped it's like no we, we did sit and watch it so i'd have to remember where we got up to exactly though it was around the dog show but like before the dog show they went to speak to the woman and she was like i need you to to dispose of this dog and I was like oh this is it's gonna be some weird space alien dog <laughs> and uh, that was as far as we got and the whole thing of um I've forgotten Lou's, Lou's character name but Lou like absolutely abysmally failing uh, to gamble Okay, we successfully made it through the gym without any casualties, but now we have the gym leader fight. With Gunny, yeah, yeah, that one. So yeah, so me, me, me and Spook were watching that, and I'm like, we should finish that at some point. As with most things, me and Spook are very bad at finishing things. I mean, I, I think everybody knows I'm terrible at finishing things. But, like, we started watching The Witcher and didn't finish it. We started watching Stranger Things and didn't finish it. We started watching Arcane and didn't finish it. We're just bad. We're just bad. Because we just inevitably end up going back onto YouTube and being like, oh, let's just watch Markiplier scream at Minecraft. Okay. Alright, sit up properly for this blue, you need to pay attention. They said that a rainbow hued Pokemon will come down to appear before a truly powerful trainer. I believe that tale, so I have secretly trained her all my life. As a result, I can now see what others could not. It's a shadow of the person who will make the Pokemon appear. I see a shadow of the person who will make Pokemon appear. I believe that person is me. You're going to help me reach that level. Oi! Oh no, he's called Dudley in this one, apparently. I've been taken to see the manager! I watch nothing other than D&D &D shows and even then I'm, I also sometimes don't finish them. That's the thing, I spend, I spend a lot of time streaming. You can't, can't watch D&D shows while I'm streaming. I used, to, I used to be able to keep up with D&D &D shows because I would watch them while doing university work. Now when I'm working, I'm streaming so I can't have D&D shows on in the background. Of course you've got, like, fucking one HP left. Mmm, Angie.
It's me. It's like we're not we're not gonna do, risk any like fancy switch leveling. The ghouling is our toughest boy. So he is he is stronger than our rival, but only by like three levels. But you guys have seen the level difference, like you know, there, there's if you want you could go grind in the grass in between fighting the rival and fighting this guy, but there's not. The most training you've got is the other trainers in the gym. I hate that, I hate that seed bomb. I'm gonna heal up next turn. Transform to normal type. You fall! <laughs> you fallen right into my trap! Why are you still alive? <laughs> Sandstorm is great because it does neut neutralize, uh, it does actually neutralize Sturdy. I, I, I like how at the start I was like, ah, oh, you got fucking Sturdy because you didn't die, but no, it doesn't. Because, oh, it might have done because it's rock type. Get that, I'm done. Muck transformed into a fool. <laughs> a fool of a muck. Hey, G. Suspicious. It's just a little bird. Ah! <laughs> you know how he's like, uh, there's a rainbow Pokemon, which is Hoa. What if this Pidgey has uh, Sacred Flame, uh, Hoa's like signature move? It does have secret power apparently. Ouch. Woo, we good. The manager. I don't think our potentials are so different, but you seem to have something more than I. So be it. This badge is yours. We have received the fog badge. I have to update the UI. Uh, bah, 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 bah. But having the fog badge, Pokemon up to level 50, including traded Pokemon, will obey you. Pokemon will be able to use Surf. Here's another thing. I want you to have this. One more thing. TM30. It's Shadow Ball. Probably isn't. Blast Burn? Blast Burn? Oh, hell, okay. Okie dokie. Blast Burn for when you really want them dead. Alright, uh, give me a moment, chat. Files, overlays, badges, fog badge. Defeating the manager, we have actually unleashed the Karen. Now we must defeat her. Eh. 
move that down there. I can't see it because it's so small. I'm like squinting at my UI. Fire Red Leaf Green, and I suppose Hot Gold Soul Silver. Um, they introduced uh, three moves. Uh, I don't know if there's like a community name name for them, but they were very powerful moves that were intended for the starters. It was literally like when you beat in the game, you could go to a place, and uh, someone would be like, "If you bring me a fully evolved starter, I will teach them a powerful." Move. And those three moves were Blast Burn, Hydro Cannon, and Frenzy Plan. And they all were basically the same, they just had different uh, typing. And they were damage 150, accuracy 90, I believe. Um, I don't know if they are still starter exclusive. But yeah, Blast One, yeah. Foe is raised by a fire explosion, however the user must rest. Damage 150, accuracy 90. Considering that I think Hyper Beam is damage 120. Hyper Beam Pokemon. Hyper Beam. Uh, oh no, it's the same. Hyper okay, so Hyper Beam is a, a elementless, essentially. It's a normal type. So this is, this is elemental Hyper Beam. Yeah. Yeah, li literally as you just said. <laughs> Chat delay. Yeah, power 150, accuracy 90, you have to rest on the next turn. So they, they made an three elemental hyper beams that were starter exclusive. So that's what Blast Burn is, and that's why I'm like, oh, okay. Because if hyper beam wasn't scary, imagine hyper beam, but if you had a, a super effective of it. Yeah, Blast Burn. Who can learn Blast Burn? Charizard, Mew, unsurprisingly. Typhlosion, Hisuian Typhlosion, Delphox, Syndrace, Skeledurge, Blaziken, Inferno, Bembor, Incineroar, blah 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 blah. Yeah. So it's not even like you could teach it to- you can't even teach it to like a Charmander or a Charmeleon, and it has to be a Charizard. So it's a powerful move, we don't have a Pokemon that can learn it. Oh, what the fuck did you just type? They aren't well at least in Go They Aren't. What? They aren't well at least in Go They Aren't. Oh, comma, commas, core. They aren't, comma, well at least in Go They Aren't. Commas. What did the Oxford comma do to you? My brain hurts. Save state. There we go. Hello, class. Welcome to my lecture on the Oxford Carver. Oh, god damn it! I just got here. <laughs> Snatcher. Okay. Well, actually, since we're doing a reload, and since it is uh, literally halfway through the stream, because we stream for three hours and it's one and a half hours in, I'm gonna go pee. So I'll be right back. Go fill up any beverages you have so that you can stay hydrated in this heat. Right, break stream, let's go.
let's see how we do. Um, something I do need to do ever so slightly. Oh, I misclicked and fucked it. God fucking damn it. God fucking damn it, me. I come back and I'm like, I just gotta fix something real quick, and then I misclick and I actually make it worse. Uh, life is suffering. I need to move ever so slightly. Son of a bitch. Switch, 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 there we go. Okay. Okay. Ah. Ah, shit, no, wait, ah, oh, I went through all that time when I was accidentally doing the top screen. Yeah, I I goofed up the the capture of the, I goofed up the capture of the screen. Close enough. Jesus self, don't mess with that again. Ah. Okay. <laughs> right. Uh we uh, the route that we will be going now, um, we can do various routes, actually. Blue use Confuse on itself, it's super effective. It doesn't take much. It doesn't take much. Save state. Right, I believe that we're starting to get into the area where the, uh, level growth between, like, gyms and, like, the wild Pokémon is a bit on the drastic side and also we need to have somebody no surf i mean beguling knows dive so we might swap dive for surf i think it won't be as good statistically Zelda no surf just so we don't have growth maybe.
luckily, if we let Baggin have an ice type, a water type move, we can get that stab, which might actually be nice. Maybe we should actually let Baggin have a water type move. I feel like we haven't used Faint in the slightest, and Ice Ball's not very strong, though. But I feel like Faint, at least, we haven't used. Ugh, let's get back in a water type move. You're still gonna lead it d dive later, though. That's true! We sequence broke the game. We've already got dive. Oh no, we can't use it. We haven't got the badge. We haven't sequence broke the sequence broke. Gonna get rid of faint. There you go. Gone back in it actually has a water type move, so we're gonna get that stab. Which is nice. Okay, well, I'm gonna put my feet back on the desk to get them in front of the fan. So I remember when we had that heat wave last year, there was a big emphasis on like if you cool your feet down, it helps cool down the rest of your body, because we've got a lot of blood vessels close to the surface in the feet. Ice fan. Is a useful move. We have lots of useful moves, to be fair. Iron Tail. I think Iron Tail is better than Steel Wing. Maybe we should let Fly go on. I don't know. Is anybody else like me with TMs where it's always in it's always like, oh I only have one? Time to never use it. Right. I believe this way will be a body of water. 42! New route! Game just gives us Earthquake. <gasps> oh my god, what if we put Earthquake in the game? Do you want a new Earthquake, big boy? Do you want, do you want stab bonus Earthquake? Sorry that I bumped into you. Did I hurt you? Please don't cry. Here, take this. Oh. It's a move called Strength. When a Pokemon learns that it can move boulders out of your way. Enjoy happy magic climbing. Oh, now I have to have Strength. Oh, God. Ah! Why did I think there was a grass patch down here? How many Pokeballs have I got? Not a lot, actually, in the grand scheme of things. And I still don't have any Quick Balls, which is the most upsetting part. I never use TMs, usually, unless it's False Life or a Sleep Paralysis move. Scarlet and Violet adding in the TM machine made me way less stingy on TMs. Because you can just get that you can just get more. You you can just get more. Again, good quality of life improvements being added to the Pokemon Pokemon games. Um quick ball. So silver. Where do I get quick balls? The department store? That's not true, we went there! Or is it based on how many gyms you have? That you've beaten. Gen 2... I like how I clicked on the, start the, the, part the link to the start part Ugh. I clicked on the link to the department store page and it lists all the stuff, and it's like, nope, there's no quick ball on here. And I'm like, but on the quick ball page, you said that you could buy them from here. You can only buy them in Johto? What? In Kanto, sorry? Here to Cerulean, Vermilion, Saffron, Lavender, Fuchsia, Pokemarts, and the Safari Zone Gate. You can, in Heart Gold, Soul, Silver, you get. Quick balls from. That's surely Kurt can make them. Surely Kurt 
can make them. Pokeball guide. Kirk can make level, moon, friend, lore, love, fast and heavy. Can't make quick balls. What the fuck? How am I only just learning this? No! Quick ball, my beloved! This is awful. This is awful! I guess we are being prevented from using our beloved quick ball, so we have to get some more regular balls, I guess. We went from 8k to 18k. Wild. learning about the randomized nuzlocke is having as much type variety in your moves is useful because you can keep certain pokemon like out for longer and things like that like you may not necessarily need to split it's to do like with type matchups you know of like oh if you've got on a ground type you're probably more likely to have like a two ground type moves and like a rock type move which, you know, those two have similar crossovers, but when you've got a ground-type Pokémon that has a fire move, a water move, and an and iron move, it's like, well, that's, that's decent coverage. Uh, right, this is... Mount Mortar. I was like, this isn't Mount Silver, it's the other one. Mount Mortar and the Waterfall Cave. Well... I always feel obligated to save, even though if I fail, I fail. There's a barrel in the water. Cute. Wow, we got that entire room with no encounter. Oh, what do we get? A lair on a level thirteen lair on, not a very high level lair on. Interesting. I feel like I'm gonna hurt you. I'm going to. I'm going to hurt you. I feel. <laughs> Maybe the heavy ball. I kind of want to open with a great ball. Hmm. What if I did a poker catch calculator? I think that is a thing. Pokemon Catch Alcalator. And this is a Gen 4 game, I believe. Alright, our Pokemon is Leron. The level is 13. It's at 100% health. Has no status. We use a great ball, 19% chance, that's not great. We use a heavy ball, 9% chance, okay, it's not as heavy as I thought. Um, 
So the Great Ball is our best, best option. Apparently it's not heavy enough for a heavy ball. It's heavy, but not heavy enough. Which you would think. You would think it would be heavy enough. But I, gu I guess heavy balls are for like, real tanking chonkers. Yeah, to be fair, Agron, 800 pounds. Laron, 260. It's a quarter of the, the, the weight. Uh, I'm gonna try a Great Wall, but we, this is less than 20% chance. I'm so much stronger than it. 20%? 20%! Let's go! Twenty percent. Let's fucking go. Loves iron ore. Groups of them fight for territory by bashing one another with their steel bodies. What do we name Laron? What do we name a Laron? This thing doesn't evolve until level forty-two. God damn it! Why is all the Pokemon that I have don't evolve until later? What do I call the Laron? L.A. Iron. Nah, nah. You gotta remember. You gotta remem remember. Anticip was was the was the different one. We need to do multi connection names. Um. Laron. Laron evolves from Aaron. Uh, Aaron... Aaron Hansen from Game Grumps. Game Grumps... Patia. What? Explain. America, explain! Waiting for chat delay. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Anticipate bright hyphen Haitian. There we go. Anticip and patient. There you go. Thank you, Cole. Anticipation. Save. I'm only level 13. Again, we just went up against a gym that was like 25. And the wild Pokemon are level 13. Okay, this is still Route 42. 
what level are you going to be? This is my secret place. Get lost, outsider. Esteban! This is the queen, okay. I was thinking we should name it Faye at first. Aw, oh, bless. To be fair, I have a um, Agron in Pokemon Go that is called Faye because it knows Thunder. And I thought, that's neat. So I do I do have an Agron called Thane. Pagooling is getting a higher level than everyone else, but I am now starting to get into the area of like we can lead with the ghouling, and I can always do a little bit of grind leveling on, on off stream to uh, get the rest of the team up to scratch. Mahogany! And most importantly, the Pokemon Center. Alright, what is the recommended order? I feel like it's Cyanwood... Uh, uh... Frick, I've forgotten the name of the town. The Steel-type one, then it's Ice, and then it's Dragon. Yeah. Yeah, Fighting, Steel, Ice, then Dragon is the suggested order. So even though we're in Mahogany Town, we're like two badges before we should be fighting this gym. And in fact, we can't because the Lake of Rage seen the guy with the black cape who's been going backwards and forwards between here and the Lake of Rage saying strange radio waves are being transmitted. Who is he, I wonder? Who is he indeed? I forgot that they have the tree that has the, the antenna sticking. And this guy will not let you pass it. Hiya, kid! I see you near Hockey Town. Such a new, you should try a yummy rage candy bar right now. Just yours for 300. Want one? Oh, why not? Just a souvenir shop. Nothing suspicious. <laughs> Nothing suspicious about it. No need to be alarmed. Great. Totally normal sign. Have you seen the Gyarados rampage at the Lake of Rage? I, went, oh, 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 Gar I was about to say, I wonder if our Gyarados is going to be a Gyarados. It isn't because of Pseudo Wudo. But before we do that, I'm going to level up more. What's the other side of Mount Mortar like? Do you know? If you can beat me, I'll let you know. It's not that far a walk, my guy. Come on, Slee. Little. Little. Huh? Normally I'd swap out, but level 15. <laughs> and a magic harp, huh? Look out, he knows judgment. me spawn near me so I caught it. I, I caught a couple of those today when I went out for my walk. Another reason why I went out, I realised that they had the thing of like, oh, a, bun a couple of the Scarlet and Violet Pokemon are spawning. And I was like, I actually do have the time to just go for a walk. I should go do that. I should go touch grass and go collect Pokemon. So I did. Oh, fromage. Hmm. 
Cristiano, the footballer. No. There's an ice up there. Hey, should I go in the water for our Route 42 encounter? Or should I go in the grass for our Route 42 encounter? What do we think? We got lucky with the last one. Why do I feel like that the, the laws of you know the laws of nature require me to fail the next one? The grasshopper bot is out as well. I can't get to it at the moment. Eh. Little grasshopper. They're not steel type, are they? They're not. They're not actually robots, are they? I know that lo the the it's called N it's nimble, which is meant to be a play on word of nimble and nim because it's a little insect. Yeah. And I know that low kicks is meant to be locust and kicks because it it kicks you with its legs. But low kicks literally sounds like a trainer brand. Even though I'm not doing anything, I can't leave my workplace to poke one. That is valid. Technically I could, but I imagine it wouldn't do me very well. Could you imagine if I just left the stream running and just AFK'd to go catch Pokemon? I want to say that they are, but I'd have to double check. I feel like they're not. It's just the fact that you said robot and I'm like, I don't think it is a robot. Oh yeah. Um, I guess we'll go in the grass? over the water? What is it? A Wisma. Okay. Hmm, I'll be on 27 if I use a Pokeball. 40 if I use a great ball. I could try. Uh, I could try a Pokeball. What is Wisdom in there? Oh, you weren't having it, huh? Wisma, your days are numbered because there is a sandstorm. few times. Be named for Wiesmer. Right. So Wiesmer, despite its name, uh, like, tends to scream. It's bug dark, but it's a freaking transformer, so it's a robot. Is it? I mean, it's not. <laughs> I wouldn't say it. No, I don't see it. I'm afraid I don't see it. Maybe that's just me, though. Da 
Its legs fold open from its previous evolution. Because it's a because it's a bug. Because it's a bug. <laughs> It's a bug. It, sh it sheds its it sheds its skin and becomes a bug. Confused. Apparently, it does have inspirations from Carmen Rider, which is interesting. Lowkicks appears to be based on the superheroes from the Carmen Rider franchise. The titular riders from the franchise typically have an insect motif, most commonly associated with the grasshopper, and have a belt used to transform into the mass superhero. Uh, they usually have a limitation on how long uh, the character can hold their transformation. All of them have a finishing attack known as the Rider Kick. All of these elements are present in low kicks. This is based of Carmen Rider. Anyway, um, Wisma. I got dist I got distracted googling low kicks. What is Wisma? Uh, it always takes me forever to come up with names. Wismer, Wismer, Wismer. Uh... So, uh, Wismers do actually scream, despite their name. Uh, we have the. Whenever we scream, we're going, ah! Like our at emote. Because uh, we made that emote. Uh, where did we go from emote? We go from emote to uh, stickers, because emotes and stickers are fairly similar. Maybe just sticker. Maybe we can just call it sticker. Big la bit lackluster, maybe. Save. So it evolves at level 20, so I could do some grinding with that uh, off screen and again, uh, much like with Fromage, uh, save it evolving for next week. Uh, right, so I fought all of you. This is still Route 42, so I don't get to catch whatever is in it. Bro. Ooh, petal dance, that's not great. Good thing the ghouling is tough as shit. Revival herb, that's not helpful. Why 
is this water so much higher level than the actual grass? Spell tag? Is that the one that keeps Pokemon away? No, it's the one that boosts ghost type Pokemon. Oh. This is still Mount Mortar, so it's not a new, not a new encounter either. Do they lure I don't know if I want to do that just yet. I don't remember what that leads to. Okay, so this water, a little on the spicy side. In fact, I'm just gonna give you a little top up, buddy, because you're a little, you're in the, you're in the yellow, which does scare me a little bit. But we're good. We didn't have to, but it was better to be safe than sorry. Okay, so that water in theory is good for leveling, but only for cautious leveling. Uh, I just I'm just thinking because I'm like, technically we want to go west to continue the game because to the east might be a little out of our range however i just remembered that if you do the lake of rage like story bit i think you can get the xp share which would be a game changer i'm gonna go i'm gonna go overland because overland is apparently safer I suppose it wouldn't evolve into a Garchomp, so that's fine. We have a Flygon. Superior. Enjoy four times weakness to ice, you ground dragon. I missed. That's what I get for being cocky. That's how I feel sometimes, Gabby. Ah! A snubble again. hesitated then. My brain fully disconnected for a couple of seconds. Little top up for me. What's up here? A little shinx. I guess technically whenever we're having wild encounters, there are it's the two extremes that we want. We either want something that is fully evolved and very good, or we want something that is not is like evolves at a lower level. And, and and so that we can like essentially get a re-roll off it. If it's 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 the mid-tier ones that are a bit irritating, actually, like the Lara. 
Like, Leron is okay, but it's not going to become an Agron, and it doesn't evolve until level 40. So it's like, ugh. Oh, fist plate. We keep getting the Arceus plates! These are supposed to be randomized. Hey, look, a Skarmory. Will. Hey, that's that direction explored. Quagsire, huh? Look at that face! Does that look like the face of mercy? Oh, it paralyzed me. Oh. Sorry, let's look at Bagooling's stats a sec. Is he- he's hit a hundred and something? A hundred defense? No wonder he's so goddamn tanky! No one even comes close! What the heck? No wonder he's so beefy! There's a boulder to push with strength there. Oh, a slack off. Ah. <sighs> I like how a slack off is faster than Bagooling. Level 13, the slack off is faster than Bagooling. Oh, right, I'm paralyzed, my speed is reduced. Him tonk. Mm -hmm. Yeah, my my admiration for uh, Hippowdon has increased dramatically from this new slot. See you later. Bye, Court! We're gonna be finishing in half an hour, so. <laughs> Thanks for coming, as always. I'm not gonna fight you while the ghouling's paralyzed. I've decided. Oh, a Rose Raid! That would have been maybe kinda handy, actually, having a, a grass type. Swift, huh? Shame my uh, physical defense is so high. The baby that grows up to have diabetes. Oh no! Why are you gonna be so mean to Tatini like that? I was just checking. Yeah, I'm gonna assume, I can never remember, but because the defense is slightly highlighted in red and special defense is slightly highlighted in blue, that we actually have boosted defense from our nature as well. Which always, uh, it, it confuses me because my brain is always like, well, red is normally the color that you give to bad things. Neutral. Are you neutral? Yeah, you're neutral. 
or it's, you've got in decreased defense and low and increased speed, but because you're naturally slow, it balances out. Neutral. Uh, yeah, increased speed, lower defense. That's why she got walloped in the fight. She is not defensive in the slightest, good lord. And um, neutral. We have we have three neutrals. Wow. Let's just speed this up slightly. I can't get through doors when I've got the fast forward on. Oh yeah, he's not gonna let me through. Uh, this is the store thing? No. Favorite radio station Pokemon Oh, that's the thing I should check. Has the radio station been overrun yet? Oh wait, no, I checked the radio from... Mahogany Town. That's terrible, isn't it? Turn that off. See, so that's the thing. The Poker Gear radio is neat in concept of like, oh, you can put different music on, but it doesn't keep it the moment you change zones. So I felt like you just never end up using it. Because it's like, oh, I gotta turn the music back on again every time I go into a different room. Just, just don't use it. That didn't do a lot of damage at all. That's better. A weasel? Boy, boy. And he's gone. Right, uh, we can't beat that. Beat that, I say, like it's a, a boss to get overcome. I've been poisoned, but we've got pitcher berries. Pitcherberry. See, this is why we're growing pitcher berries in the pots. I forgot that you can do multiple waterings by doing that. Appear. Something. It's a something. Come on, goose. Come on, goose. Arceus 
breastplates. Give me something else. Give me a fucking ultra ball. You know? Give me a quick ball. There's a bajillion pokeballs in this game and you keep giving me the Arceus plates? Right, uh, I gotta tackle this body of water again because there's an item over there that I want. Why is this water, like, the most intimidating thing we've encountered so far? Wait. Oh, I need rock climb to get that. What's in here? Something. A leaf stone! Oh, I think we already have one of these. Well, if we get a gloom, then we can evolve it. Really? <laughs> Avatar! Aww. Actually, a low level avatar is a bad thing. Because we wouldn't be able to evolve it for ages. Whoopam! Ultra Ball! There we go! I think it heard me. Quick Ball! That's a, that's an encounter. Quick ball, moonstone, ship up. Can't do that. mountain was Laron. We could have had an Arceus! And now I'm going to punch God. And win! <laughs> oh, and now I'm in Glitch City. killed god and broke the world so you know that's that's just what happens isn't it don't you hate it when you go to all that effort to destroy god and it turns out the world is like ah dang it who could have foreseen i uh, uh Claw, which I think we also already have. We just casually encounter God in a regular old mountain cave. He's like, hey, if you guys see my plates, I keep dropping them. Oh god damn it, now I'm paralyzed. in this goddamn cave. Man, Arceus really did actually be like, hey, have you seen my plates? I think I dropped them. Well, 
for our efforts, we got a bunch of Arceus plates and a singular Ultra Ball. God. Thank you, sweetie. Remember to share it in the Discord, in the uh, Twitch Clips channel. Hey, buddy. You have a level 20 for champ. Okay. Level 20 for champ that knows dive, apparently. Extreme speed, but it's not fast enough for me. Hello. It's a spook. Oops, it's gone. And it's gone. Stop giving me your number. Bird! No more bird. No, I'm not. No. Uh, right, encounter time. fully evolved, I guess. Start thinking of where we can go with Venomoth, guys. Venomoth. Level 16. 10% chance with a Pokeball, that's not great. 16 with a Great Ball, also not fantastic. 19 with an Ultra Ball. The netball. Netball time. Come on, thirty-three chance. Lump. Come, come on, hun. You know the ruling. Where, where do you go from lamp? If you go from moth to lamp, we need four or five jumps. You can't just have one jump. Where do you go from lump? You're the one who came up with this naming convention! If we catch it. <laughs> ah! Lump leads to a dimmer switch. Okay. We want to stall and use our last netball when it's lower in health because the uh, sandstorm will whittle it down. Dimmer switch to Stangy, Stangy to Onion. We're calling it Onion? Okay. Oh, well, the Great Ball works. Okay. Cool. It's called Venomoth called Onion. Onion leads to blue. What? Why me? How does an onion lead to me? How does it. What? We'll call it Onion. And I, I don't. And you come up with the last. last oh, okay. Un, onion, onion leads to uh, garlic, which leads to magrat garlic from the Terry Pratchett books. It's called magrat. Magrat, the venomoth. Oh yeah. Yes, her name is magrat. Her mother couldn't spell. 
Would have been literally, literally the first line is Magret Garlic would have been called Margaret, but her mother couldn't spell. Ta da! Mag Rat with only one T. Magret. female so that works out lovely Ta -da! Queen Margaret no nope, Magret specifically Let's see. okay so we have a venom off that we just have now because um, it won't evolve we did really well with catching today. We we also very gratefully had no deaths. And um we got a gym badge. A sharp beak boosts flying type moves. This would boost my flying type moves if I had any. It runs away before you can punch it. Have you guys ruminated any more on the random encounters? Core was of the opinion that we should allow them if they are indeed random, rather than being hunted. But I don't know, it's part of the rules of the Nuzlocke. Technically Entei was on this route when we entered it, so we could have encountered it first time, but we didn't. Just like that, we're done. Ba -ba -ba -ba. A white apricorn. Olivine City, that's the name I couldn't remember. Olivine. Oliver, Oliver, Oliver. Too slow. Uh, I, I miss my VR friends. I haven't been in VR because it's just too warm to have the headset on. So hopefully uh, at the end of this week it will be cooler and I'll actually be willing to go in VR again. We got two dots on this. Sandstone dot and burn dot. Wasn't enough to take it out though. Speaking of warm, drink more water. stream instead of designing retextures I might of course you have a legendary why wouldn't you I think I might start 
designing another avatar base. I think it is time. I've talked about it a couple of times over the last few months, but I don't have any comms to do at the moment. So I think it might be time to work on another avatar base. And just uh, pause it whenever I have a comm to work on. I think I want to do, like, an owl. I kind of want to do, like, a bird. Like, I, I think, I'm thinking, like, Rito-esque. So the wings are also the hands, rather than uh, Arapocra-esque, where you've got arms, legs, and a set of wings on the back. Which I know is unusual for me, given the, the wings. <laughs> But I don't know, that's that's kind of what I, I have a, an itching to make. A kind of Rito-esque owl. Let's be honest, the uh, the Legend of Zelda uh, Tears of the Kingdom probably had a big influence on me wanting to make it Rito-styled, even though I haven't played that still. <laughs> I'll have to get it for Christmas. How is Bagooling doing after that fight? Oh, still pretty good, actually. Oh! Hello? Oh, what you're holding is what they call a, a Pokedex. I haven't seen one of those in ages. Uh, my name is Balba. I used to run the Safari Zone in Fuchsia, but it was becoming too out of date with new entertainment options coming out. I decided to go overseas to learn the newest technology and open a state-of-the-art Safari Zone in Cyanwood. It may be more than a coincidence that we are chatting. Why don't we register each other's number in the poker gear? I can give you a call once as far as it is open before I call anyone else. Do you want to register? Fine. That's the way. Because the safaris are- I do actually want to know when the safaris are open. I'll let you know over the poker gear once it's ready. To be fair, that sounds like that sounds like it could have been one of those um no no choice choices where you go no and he goes, oh come on! Yes or no? No. Oh, come on! Fine. There we go. A grin apricon. Just what you least expected, I'm Cameron the photographer! You look so photogenic, why don't I take a picture? Yes! Take a picture at the party, let's go! Look at this squad! Yay! Ooh. This call is like ingrained into my brain from the original Gold and Silver. Ooh. 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 Heatwave! Okay, we've got a lot of fire type TMs. Oh, they actually have a silo now. Oh, and the sick one is in here, right? Mm, his cry is weak. Mumu is sick, she needs lots of orange berries. Sick, she needs lots of orange berries. I have none. I'm sad. I will need to grow some more. Else I can't give me milk no more. This here farm's got famous milk. Almost everyone drinks it. It'll give me lots of milk if I feed it lots of berries, I reckon. Our milk even goes out to Kanto, so if our milk tank won't give us milk, we're in trouble. Wee! Poor Nuna. Poor Nuna. What do you do? What you fur? What are ye for? Webster. Snorlax, huh? It'd be a shame if someone had a fighting type move. Masquerade. There we go. 
Oh, are they, am I, do you see that dramatic colour change on my screen? That's because we just ticked over to 5 o'clock. Which I guess means uh, I should save. I was going to see if I could get to Sandwood, but uh, I guess we'll have to wait for next week to see if we do that. Ah! This has been fun. I love Pokemon Symbols. It seems like you guys too, because there's always uh, a couple of people around watching, which I appreciate. Right, uh, let's raid into Breeze. Uh, let me just mute this and make sure that Breeze is still live. Ooh, let's press this button actually. Wow, give me a. There we go, there is our schedule. As I said before, me and Spook have been discussing maybe making some tweaks to this. So I guess keep an eye on this space. We shall see. And um, yeah, it's on tomorrow's art stream. I think I'm gonna maybe sketch out some designs for a new VR chat avatar thing. So I'm gonna make another one. Mm, design a bird. Right, raid. I reckon we're gonna rain to a bird. Six hours in VR. Oh damn! Oh, oh, that's, oh, that's a big I actually don't know if that live uh, for uh, 24 hours now. As well. Indeed. Big stream. Yeah. If you see a different time, it's because the, we have blue screens. Like. Oh, I think they are online because they just responded to someone in chat. Cool, oh, right. Uh, Bree, Bree's just moved to a new house. Our house warming. Well, the so, past week I, got know, to I guess the radio know you're a little bit. Great, great message, I guess, is uh, <laughs> happy house warming. I don't think I'm naughtiness. Hun. <laughs> what we did was quite vanilla. <laughs> There we go. Alright. Vanilla is one of my favorite flavors. Oh, Start yeah, the raid. Remember to refresh the screen if the so rain is not vanilla. appearing on like, your end. Because <laughs> Twitch but, is vanilla functional. Is so interesting because like people use it as like the default of things, but vanilla is a really nice flavor. And great, I will see you tomorrow. Making